All I want you to do is create a piece of music that will make people stand to their feet and cheer. No, oh, no pressure. My name's Tom Reeves. Well, you know, I wear a lot of hats. I'm a producer, engineer, drummer, musician. Can you say that in the same sentence? And I own a studio in Nashville, Tennessee. And I have the greatest job on earth. More cowbell, absolutely. In fact, clients said, man, all we need is more cowbell. And I just happened to have one of those big 10-inch Latin percussion cowbells with gray tape wrapped around it and all beat up. Very calmly reached over and picked it up. And, and he went, now that's customer service. <laughs> just was luck, man. Yeah. Just happened to have it sitting there. You know, I look at myself as an implementer. That's a big word, isn't it, for a drummer? I'm the guy who builds the house, I'm not the architect necessarily. I'm the guy that knows who to call and puts all the people in place, gets the schedule together, and then, uh, in my case, sits down and puts the hands on it. Oh man, I moved to town to be a drummer. Traveled for 12 years, full time on the road. Came up out of the Christian music industry. I got off the road, sat down in front of a console one day. It was like a husky in snow, man. I was like, yeah. This is it. This feels good right between the monitors and I've been there ever since. I'm still a guy that gets a lump in his throat when you hear this big moment in a song and the Whitney Houston tune from The Bodyguard, I Will Always Love You. There's that moment, you know, it just gets there and the arranger had the track stop down. She takes the pickup note and bam, you've got a cold modulation and the track just goes wah like that. Yeah, you know, that was it right there. One of the things that makes me different is what we've already done, the amount of projects I've worked on. And the other thing is I think that I, f I focus on the music. I'm planning ahead to not be overwhelmed with all the technology and the details, what microphone we're going to use and what preamp is going to drive that mic. And that's all well and good. We have to do those things. But I'd rather talk about the music and what the end result's going to look like and sound like. Definitely competitively priced because I stay lean. I don't mind taking a budget and looking at it and uh, knowing where we're at, knowing where we're at along the way. I want a client to look like a genius for choosing us to work on that project. I have people that I work with now that, uh, you know, they just hand things over and say, look, this is what I need done. Call me at this point in the process. For a client to not have to be there every second that they have that trust in us, that's, you know, that's what we're working for. Most of my clients turn out to be friends. And I'm not just saying that, they just are. 80% of my client base, I've been working with them for 15, 20 years. I think you'd probably hire me first and foremost because you feel comfortable with me. And second, you've listened to my work and you go, I want that mix. I want that size and that weight. I'm getting tired of holding my gut in. <laughs> so that's what's surprising. How hard that really is.